hello and welcome back to the channel in this video i'm going to talk to you about glycerin how to use glycerin for skincare formulation and also a very good alternative to glycerin when formulating skincare but glycerin is used between the it all depends on what you are making uh, mainly i use it from sometimes i use a five percent using a three percent and if i'm making a lotion i use my glycerin to force uh, dissolve my xanthan gum sometimes or I use water to hydrate my xanthan gum so glycerin can be used to uh, dissolve the particles of your xanthan gum so that's one of the use of glycerin also because it's a good humectant you can also use it to improve the you know the moisturizing property of your products is mainly used in the water phase so your formulation not in the oil phase so remember we have the water phase oil face and the cooldown face glycerin is best used in the water face because it's, it can withstand heat now here the question that is uh, asked so before i go to that you can use it when you're making a lotion for instance you can use it at three percent or you can use it at five percent so that's the proportion i've used it for several years and that's really worked for glycerin is very powerful you can use glycerin to make toner you can add it to your serum um, very good for dry skin okay now glycerin is beautiful here is how it looks that how it feels is a thick okay it's a thick liquid it's water soluble okay it's more like castor oil even though castor oil is thicker but that's how glycerin is glycerin should not be applied to the skin directly okay and it's water soluble so if you add water to it It's soluble in water okay as you can see right it's not soluble in oil so you don't want to add it uh, to oil and expecting it to solubilize okay that's about it it's used very good to use to make toner and other great skincare product that's glycerin for it and you know i always recommend glycerin vegetable uh, vegetable glycerin okay and make sure it's usp 99.7 percent this is the cosmetic grade and this is what you want to use okay 99.9 percent .9 and make sure is the alcohol free one okay so if the vegetable glycerin is usually uh, alcohol free so make sure you go for the usp 99.97 99.7 a lot of people just buy glycerin for the name but it has to be usp 99.7 if you want to make skincare products now if you don't want to use glycerin at all there's a better alternative a better alternative that helps to boost the uh, efficacy of your preservative so i'm going to take glycerin and set it aside the best substitute for glycerin in your skincare formulation is propanidial 1,3 propanidial 1,3 is a good pen skin penetration enhancer and it really uh, is a good emectant also i mean a lot a lot of skincare brands use it i mean it's one of the number one you know substitute for glycerin the most natural skincare school use is a good substitute for boutique glycol so proper i mean propylene glycol this is a good substitute it's a natural substitute for it and you can add it at the water phase it's a good emollient humectant and it help, uh, helps to you know to aid help your skincare product to properly you know penetrate the skin so in a way it breaks the barrier right it's more expensive okay glycerin is very cheap i mean not not 100 but at least it's cheaper than this this is a bit more expensive and the good thing about this is that it's 100 natural it's boosted the efficacy of your preservative and also helps skin moisturization so when you're making dry skin products you want to include this trust me you will love love the feel also you can also use it to dissolve the particle of your uh, xanthan gum okay before you add it to water so just make sure you you just like the way you use glycerin you can use this the same way you use glycerin but this is a master right now when you're making great and stable skincare product you can use it most of the time i use it at three percent okay i don't use more than that sometimes 
I use that place at three percent even though glycerin you can use it up to five percent right but when you're formulating skincare product three percent of this is good in the water phase you can use it as an emectant the added advantage is that it boosts okay the power uh, the function of your preservative it goes a long way so keep that in mind this is a good substitute for for glycerin whether you're making toner lotion or the skin care so let me know if you have any question about these uh, two emectant okay if you have any question about using them let me know just drop in the comment box below remember to click the subscribe button and the notification icon to be notified anytime i upload new video before i go i want to show you how um how proper denial is proper denial is a bit this how proper denial is okay is a bit is uh is lighter than glycerin as you can see it feels like water right is lighter than glycerin it's more like light oil okay on the other end glycerin is also water soluble okay it can dissolve in water as you can see glycerin is is thicker right so that's the difference it's lighter and more you know more skin friendly it has more power even though it's more expensive though it's going to help your skincare products stand out thank you so much for watching remember click the subscribe button <coughs> and the notification icon to be notified when i upload new videos thank you so much for watching